everybody, it is Fire Knight, and welcome to this episode of Infinity Gaming. Guys, today there is so much chaos going on right now, <laughs> but I'm here bringing you the brand new Memories of Reach DLC that has finally hit Halo 5 Guardians, and I have to say, uh, the brand new Forge piece is just absolutely insane. Uh, by the way, that is a lightning strike, which we'll kind of check that out here in a minute. But let's actually start with these brand new pieces over here. This is actually just a Trapezoids, but I put um, some textures on them. This is the brand new textures and skins that you can apply to your blocks. Like, for instance, this is Forerunner, and over here is Covenant, which you can clearly tell. Um, over here is Concrete, Wood, Stone, which is pretty cool, and Marble. So this is pretty neat to add. I was actually talking to my buddies about this at one point in time, saying, you know, they should add textures to the blocks, and they finally did, which is pretty cool to see. And um, over here is the brand new dead bodies that they have added. Like, this is the Jackal, uh, Grunt, and Elite. If you listen closely, there's insects, and you can see on the screen that there's actually insects flying around. Um, these are actually foreigner little bitty bugs here. And over here is just the default, you know, flies and stuff like that, which is also included in this DLC. This guy here is kind of creepy because he's kind of standing up looking at you. Well, sitting up, so it's pretty freaky. Um, this is the Brute Plasma Rifle, which, uh, which is pretty cool that they've added this back. I just love this gun. Uh, the brand new skulls, like this one is huge. Um, I don't know if that's even human, but this one I can see being human. Um, over here is the trash bags that you can now put on your mask with a brand new trash can and some ammo lockers with a uh, foreigner lens flare, which is pretty cool. They also added bigger um, plots of grass that you can put down on your mask. They have like the little bitty things. You actually can put like big, huge fields of grass now, which is pretty cool. Now these are thrusters, like to put on the back of an engine, which is pretty cool, along with some new fiery effects and um, a constant spark effect which is called the waterfall and um, over here is pretty cool this is the brand new kill ball plasma which I thought was pretty neat along with this black hole which is very intimidating because I'm kinda of afraid to fly in it because it literally like turns to a black screen which is pretty cool but let's come over here and check out this lightning effect which it's right here and um, it was pretty neat to see and right there it just about killed me but um it's actually pretty cool, um, so if you make like a rainy map, this would be pretty cool to put that on. So guys, this is a, a very cool DLC, so I recommend you know going in Forge and checking out all the cool new pieces that you can apply to your maps. But one thing I am kind of upset about is there is no Falcon. Now don't get me wrong, the Phaeton looks pretty cool, but we were all hoping for that Falcon to come in this DLC. But um, everybody thought it was like a big troll, like I did too, but it's alright guys, because they did make up for it. Because there was a lot of cool new pieces in this, especially in multiplayer. You got the brand new, you know, Noble Armor set, which I can't wait to get George's armor, by the way. But guys, other than that, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, definitely go and check out this DLC, because it is pretty incredible. But guys, other than that, this is Fire Knight, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.